Moped way, it is so good to see you again. Yes, you know, yes. I was just thinking about you in the last conversation that we had and how we can get our inmates that are at RRJ registered to vote. We need your help. Yes, I know. How can yeah. NAACP and Failsafe do this together? We right, realize the importance of that, you know, because for this election, we want everybody, everyone else want to vote because it's such a big, close selection. Yes. And um, what we probably can do is, you know, reach out to jail mm -hmm. and see what, you know, if they, if they can help us arrange for set up a time, a location where people that are ready or are not registered mm -hmm. can get registered to vote. That would be awesome. Yes, it would be. And that also, be awesome. uh, along the same line, we need to make sure that, that they uh, have absentee ballots. Yes. So they can vote. Not only register to vote, they got to get out the ballots and vote. Yes. So we, so we may be able to coordinate with the jail because jail, you know, mm -hmm. they say mm -hmm. receptors mm -hmm. to us coming in maybe and helping out. Yeah, I think so. And you know what I think is, is, is really important that we, whatever we do, we need to make sure that they know that they're eligible to vote. Right. You know, mm -hmm. we need to make sure that they know that if they do not, if they've not been convicted of a felony, mm -hmm. that they can vote or they've only been convicted of a misdemeanor that they can vote. So yeah. we want to make sure that we get the word to them and then we need to get as many people as possible. I'm hoping that we can get the jail to allow us to come in. Yeah, you know, I'm also hoping that, that you know, not, not, no, and another thing I just thought about is that we, we won't, might wanna be sure that they are, that they are, they're all the information is correct. That's but true. what happened is they haven't voted in the last couple of elections. That's their stuff true. might be messed up. Yeah. So we got to yeah. make it. So when we do meet with them, mm -hmm. we, or if we, we create a, a flyer, just a pre-check, mm -hmm. to find out when the last time you voted. Oh, you know yes. I mean? And that yeah. way, that'll, that'll give us a direct narrative, narrative down of what we need to do for them. Not mm -hmm. only do we may not need to register them, mm -hmm. we need to make sure that their information is correct and that their address they, uh, they're, mm -hmm. they're putting on a, a ballot is a valid ballot. That's right. If they live over in, in Carolina and then they live in Spotsylvania that's, that's and they've good. got wrong address on mm -hmm. it, you know, so we do want so so we may want to do a a pre-check. Yeah. A pre-check or something. So I, I think we definitely uh we call it with jail. Ask the jail, you know, and so can you and keep them going. can you do that part? I sure will. I that have I have a relationship awesome. with the superintendent before, you know, okay. he and I have worked with the other before. Good. And he seemed to be very receptive to, good, you know, good, doing good, something good. like that. Yeah. Well, so I I mean, think we're in good. there now. Oh yeah, feel safe. You know, so we're doing our training and yes, everything, but yeah. To be able to get those guys and gals the the uh, opportunity to continue to exercise their right to vote yes. would be a big deal. It's a lot of work, though. Yes, it is. Oh, no, but also, <laughs> don't let me forget to reach out to staff in NACP. Staff has NACP, oh, too. Absolutely. Yeah, offer staff and NACP an yeah. opportunity to be a part of yes. this endeavor yes. here, you know. That, so as soon as we hear from the jail, yes, so then we're going to we're gonna have, to, we're gonna have to hustle. Yes, yes. Because and and hopefully we can identify some people that are else would have to, to enter into the jail yeah. where they can help set up we can do that maybe. Maybe a, a, a day or two days that we uh, throughout that day, mm -hmm. you know, we spend time mm -hmm. there really getting people to register. Vote. So what today is the twenty third? Yes. The last day to register is, is uh, October, October the fifteenth, I believe. October the okay. fifteenth. I have to make sure. But yes, it is. But yes, so yeah, so whatever day so that is, don't have a whole lot of time. Don't have a whole lot of time. Don't have a whole lot of time. Mm -hmm. But we need to do it. If it's something that really, let me say, deadline for request ballots is October twenty fifth. Deadline to register is October fifteenth. Okay, so we got yes. work to do. So we got to, yeah, we got to get it done. All right, and we'll so get you're gonna talk to superintendent, talk to superintendent and hopefully yes. by no later than the end of this week, we'll yes. have an answer, have an answer to move forward. See what we got. Partner. <laughs> <laughs> All right, excellent. I love it. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, sir. Fantastic. Thank you.